हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी डिस्कस द टॉपिक्स ऑफ कंपोजिट मटेरियल इन इट द पॉलीमर मैट्रिक्स कंपोजिट्स नाउ ऑन आवर ऑनलाइन लेक्चर सीरीज आई डॉक्टर हरजीत पवार फ्रॉम एस एन डी कॉलेज ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग एंड रिसर्च सेंटर देवला टॉपिक कवर्ड फर्स्ट इज द प्रोसेसिंग ऑफ पॉलीमर मैट्रिक्स कंपोजिट्स मीन्स प्रोसेसिंग ऑफ पी एम सी नंबर सेकेंड इज अ मेथड विच इज हैंड लेअप मेथड यूज टू प्रोड्यूस कंपोजिट्स सेकेंड वन इज अ स्प्रेअप प्रोसेसेस थर्ड वन इज अ कंप्रेशन मोल्डिंग प्रोसेसेस एट प्रोसेसेस आर यूज टू प्रोड्यूस द कंपोजिट्स नाउ टर्न टू प्रोसेसिंग ऑफ द पी एम सी प्रोसेसिंग ऑफ पी एम सी having three types means processing of polymer matrix composites are classified into three type categories open mold process closed mold process and miscellaneous processes these three types i yeah, show you here then open mold having furtherly classified into number four processes hand lay up spray up tap lay up and auto clave process closed mold process is in the three types compression molding injection molding and transfer molding and miscellaneous means frustration and filament winding are the two types of the miscellaneous type of processes in this processing heat compression causes and in this reversible chemical ch- charges in the plastics which solidify the parts the plastics was not softened so the mold does not need to cool after short interval the press is open and mold part is removed any plastic remaining in the mold or plash is removed by compression here or manually in the processing of the thermoplastic polymer mold is preheated using the heater and the mold is cooled to a point where the plastic retain in a integrity to be removed from the mold without partial distortion in the also the processing of the frp frp means fiber reinforced plastics the frp is composite materials made of polymer matrix reinforced with fiber the fibers are usually a synthetic fibers like glass carbon basalt and aramid these are the processing of thermoplastics frp and thermoset now turn to the process first process open mold in which hand lay a process see the figure of the hand lay a process in left side the figure shows it this figure contains open mold which is uh, at the down side then on which the roller resin composite laminates polymer resins reinforcement are then release gel gel are also provide and in another right side there are the how the process will conduct as shown here in hand lay up method is the most common and widely used open mold composite manufacturing process it is less expensive method the mold can be simply as a plastic and can have infinite curve and edges the hand layer process is suitable for prototypes and low volume production of the fiber composite materials parts the fiber perform are placed in the mold the resin materials put are applied using brush when the resin brush or roller when resin is release from the upper side the brush or roller is used to impregnate the resin into the fabric to ensure the enhanced interaction between the successive layers of the reinforcement and the matrix material this process are shown here there are various advantages of this process cost of production is very low it is simplest method also the design changes are there 
readily made in the disadvantages it is time consuming environmental problem are because this is open process that's why the various environmental problems are occurred then the composite will have smooth surface at one side and rough surface at the other side there are some applications manufacturing of aircraft wings then motor boats train nose train control console and also in the swimming pool this types of the and lay up composites method are used now turn to second method which is spray up processes it is open mold type of techniques it is quite faster than the hand layer spray up the technique is very similar to the hand layer you are just familiar by the figure also it is advancement and automated process of hand layer process however it is use a hand gun that spray resin and chopped fiber on the mold simultaneously a roller is used to fuse these fibers into a matrix material this figure shows you in this process the operator controls thickness and consistency therefore the process is more operator is dependent in this way the spray process are done it contains the liquid resin continuous flowing chopping mechanism for the liquid resin which in nozzle are fitted then resin spray and chopped fiber then sprayed resin one let dipper there the roller and brush are used here directly spray are used these are the difference between hand lay up and spray up processes turn to next process which is compression molding it is pre-treated mold mounted on a hydraulic or mechanical press a pre prepared prepared pre uh, prepared is placed in between the two holes of the mold which are then pressed again each other to get a desired shape of the mold generally compression molding process have two types one is a preheating and another is a pressurizing see the working of this prepeg is placed in a cavity to fix mold in open position mold is closed by means of hydraulic action upper side of press which is called as a movable mold and downward side mold is the fixed type of mold and in which injection injector pin are attached and on which the charge are put up then movable mold is placed with the help of hose and it will be placed from the upper side which are shown in the both the figures the left side and the right side prepeg is placed in a cavity in the mold mold is closed by hydraulic action press is exerted to switch the resin so that it fills the mold cavity it is applied in the mold because of temperature and pressure the resin is cured this compression molding process having one is a sheet molding compounds and another is a bulk molding compounds in the sheet sheet molding process involves the placing of reinforcement such as a glass mat between sandwiching layers of thermoplastics and heating the materials to produce a single sheet of materials and bulk molding compounds by producing a billet or molten material that is placed into a compression molding press which molds the molten materials into parts there are some advantages of this compression molding one is the first is a short cycle time high degree of productivity automated process good dimensional accuracy low cost improve impact strength then disadvantages large curing time parting line present on the final product scrap cannot be reprocessed and last one is a high initial capital investment 
in this way we are familiar the three process hand lay up spray lay up and the compression molding thank you